You're going to hold it above your head with both hands like this. No matter what, Ryan, both hands on the fire in the air. This is so people know he's performing. If you hold it with one hand, it looks like you're mad about the election. Both hands are out. <laughs> All right, Ryan. Uh, hi there, ma'am. <laughs> so Ryan is going to help us. He's a nice guy. He came up here. He's happy. He's healthy. You're excited to be here. Are you right? I can tell your nipples are rock hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ryan. Right, so I'm going to get to know Ryan a little bit. Ryan, go ahead and spread them. <laughs> Ryan, is this your wallet? No. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Ryan. I just want to show everybody something. So Ryan's a smart guy. Here's why. Ryan keeps his wallet right here. Guys, when you get a wallet, if you put it in your back pocket, whenever you sit down, you're sitting on your wallet, right? But if you take your wallet and you put it in your side pocket like Ryan, whenever you sit down, your back pocket. Why does he hurt. have his paper. wallet in it's his pocket? Hard for a person to steal. Shh, quiet. <laughs> <laughs> he ran. <laughs> Could you imagine him telling the cop that's how I got robbed? <laughs> Did anybody see it? <laughs> Did he have a weapon? Well, he gave me this. <laughs> Let's get to know Ryan a little bit. So, Ryan, your father. You're a father, aren't you, Ryan? I can tell, Ryan, there's not much money in here. <laughs> there's like barely enough to tip a street performer. <laughs> yeah. Georgie. Georgie. What was performing? John, everybody, get up for John. Thanks for John. All right, John. John, right here next to me and Ryan. And then take my hand, John. <laughs> Hang on, Ryan. Let go of me, John. Wait right here, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> now you guys are good. Uh, let me get you a little more help, sir, right here in the beard. Yeah, would you mind help? Oh, you got that? Oh, yeah, my bad. I'll pick him. Right. <laughs> What's your name, man? Stacy. Stacy. Great name. Give it up for Stacy, everybody. Thanks, Stacy. Woo! Stacy, right here. Stacy, I love your costume. You look like exactly like a barista in Portland. Oh, nice. <laughs> right here. Perfect. And then, yeah, perfect. I want right. to perform. Uh huh. You want to perform, but it's for big people. Daniel, everybody, yeah, Daniel. Big 
can't hold fire, George. So, Daniel, you just grab on to Stacy. I right can't here. hold fire? All You're right, a baby. Let's do it. First, I will show you all my favorite trick with the fire. <laughs> And then, <laughs> for your grand finale, yeah. with the help of these men, we will reenact Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. Alright. Favorite trick. Very simple. Now, everybody here has seen me juggle? Some of you have seen me juggle fine. This time to make it more impressive, when I throw the flames, they will all be going behind my back. <laughs> yes, they're fine. I'm not gonna, uh, that's a joke. Yeah, you're okay. <laughs> Yeah. I would never do that. This show's too special to me. This is one of the only shows I've ever gotten to do that my father stuck around to watch, and I would not be able to do this without him. Give it up for my dad, everybody. Woo! Thanks, Dad. <laughs> 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 Alright, here we go. Hi there, how's it going? Are you two dating? Yeah. Awesome. Room for a third. <laughs> <laughs> He's small, more than her. <laughs> All right, so fire behind the back, one in the air, put in a circle, catch it. That's my favorite one. After that, four naked men help us on the show. <laughs> you guys are doing great, all right? Just wait right there. We'll set that up in just a second. Thank you all for being here. This might be one of my only shows out here this weekend. During the holidays, I try to come out and perform because it's always for my family. Um, and I mean, it takes time away from my family during the holidays. Shows. If you're here and you're having fun, Thank you for making this work well for me because I really want to do shows for people to have a good time. So thank you all for being here. Yay! Good, I'm a stranger. <laughs> <laughs> right here, right here where my foot is. 
good. Do you like surprises? Yes. Have a big surprise. You ready? Okay, listen. Come here real bad. <laughs>
good kids. Stand right here. Would you like some candy? <laughs>
He <laughs> threw it! <laughs> Take the money, Leonie. <laughs> Grab it quick, put it in your pocket. You don't have a single pocket. Hang on to it tight. Hang on to it. Take it. Yeah, take the money. It's I can one. take it. No. Because you're really privileged. You don't need it. <laughs> Please take the money so this is no longer. Thank you. You just threw it behind my case. Grab it. Hold on to it. Tight. Okay, go back to your mom and dad. You can keep that money. You don't have to give it back to me. That's yours. You earned it by coming up here, okay? Just give your mom a hug right now. You're welcome. Woo! Mom, thank you for bringing me to the show. Mom, if you love me, give Sam a 20. <laughs> She's good. Knife comes flying at you. Do the right thing. Take it like a man. All right, Eva. Go ahead. Swing that right up to me when I count to three. <laughs> you're nervous. Yeah, it's okay. It's fine. Sometimes when we're nervous, we're a little premature. Fine. I still have fun. Okay. Can you grab that? Can you grab that. We're gonna try it again. Okay. Uh, just bag up and then. Uh, Hold the knives above your head. Yeah, just as high as you can. Keep them high up, both of them. Step forward 10 inches. <laughs> I think somebody's been lying to you. Try and step. Try and step. As big of a step as you can with the knives up. Another one? You're going to hand me the knives. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> He's not going to let him throw it? Enthusiasm no. And charisma really carried that section of the show. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so guys, it's going to be the final part. I can't do this without each of you up here. Um, I'm going to have to adjust it just a little bit. So if you can, just pull it forward just a little. Keep going. You might need to back up with it. Let them pull it forward. Keep going. Keep going. I'll tell you when. And that's good. Okay. Yeah, this thing, because um, it's like, I don't know. I, I really need to rebuild it or something, but it's not in great shape, right? So I need to make sure it works. Um, you guys are doing good. Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be the final part of the show. I can't do this without all of you, but I also can't do it without these guys. Do it up for my guys, too, everybody. <laughs> and Leona and Eva, thank you both for helping me as well. I really appreciate all of your help. My name is Sam Malcolm, and I am a professional comedian. Thank you. <laughs> that is what that feels like. Yeah, okay. awesome. I do this for a living. I choose to perform outside of venues like this because even though I do perform at clubs and theaters, you can hire me for a company party and event. Not everybody can be at those shows, but out here, everybody can be here and everybody's welcome. If you look around, there's people from all walks of life. There's no politics, no religion, no race. All we have right now is the human race having fun. So thank you for taking part in that today. <laughs> That being said, if you'd like to talk politics, what a perfect time. <laughs> if you're a liberal, support my show. I'm an artist. If you're a conservative, I'm also a small business. <laughs> if you're a libertarian, I don't pay taxes. <laughs> if you're with the IRS, I'm lying. If you live in Boulder, I can't afford to, so think about it. Uh, would you guys in the back right here mind coming up a little so that train doesn't hit you? Yeah, can't let that happen again. Uh, I do this show to get back to my community and support my family where I'm from, where I grew up. I didn't have it so great as a kid. I saw a lot of awful stuff. It's important to me to do this show for the people back home, but also to make things better for the next generation. That's what we should all try to do. I'm very proud of where I come from, from a reservation in Nevada. I'm Paiute, and I'm proud of my heritage as a native. Yay! So I'd like to take a moment before I end the show to welcome all of you to our land. <laughs> After the show, pay your rent. Well, you got real quiet for that one. Huh? <laughs> They're walking away. You guys going back to Europe? <laughs> Have some blankets for you to take. <laughs> um, no, I do do this show for a living. The thing about it is, if you saw me in a comedy club or a theater, you buy a ticket to watch it. The ticket might be $25, $50, $100. You'd watch the show after you paid for the ticket here. 
Nobody pays for the commander and general. The only way I make a living is if people stay to the end, they come up afterwards and put something in my bag of what they think a ticket to my show is worth. I think that's fair and honest, though, because all of you get to decide what you thought of the show after you've seen everything I have to do. You don't have to leave a lot. $100 is fine. Again, some of you live in Boulder. That's not a joke to you. If you leave me 10 bucks, look me at fun. That's like buying me a cup of coffee or a gallon of gas. If you leave me a 20 or more, you really can't afford to do the show without people like you. You'll be supporting my family. You'll be doing what I love. And you make the show possible for people who can't always afford to leave hmm? a tip. How is he people just walk away. So if you leave a 20 or more, uh, it's a... going to make you for that. If you don't have any money, that's fine too. You can give him a tip holidays. after. I have Venmo too. Right? Tip? Mm -hmm. I didn't bring my wallet. I, I have. Right here. Give me that. Well, later, later. We'll finish here. this video. You guys, pull me to the back just a bit. Let's get Be quiet. Here we go. Everybody, uh, uh. let me know you're with me. Woo! 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 Anybody at the end thinks the show is worth $50, they see how hard I'm working, they understand how difficult it is to do a show like this, you want to help me support my family, you leave me a 50, please, let me shake your hand, but it tells me something more important than you just want to support my show, it tells me you can afford that hundred, step it up! You <laughs> <laughs> do that so seriously, let me thank you, especially this time of year, that means a lot. Let's end it together, everybody, hands in the air! Not you guys on the road, <laughs> everybody in the crowd, hands up! Now worship. <laughs> We're all gonna clap with me. George, come here. Here, come here. Not yet. Go give him a five.